What skills are required to be a really good buyer's agent? Buyer's needs are far different than seller's needs. So it's no surprise the skills needed to be really good at being a buyer's agent are different than the skills needed to be a really good listing agent. Here are some of the most important ones for buyer's agents. They need to be an excellent communicator. They need to be able to educate the buyer on the process and make sure that the buyer understands what's going on. They need to be an experienced and skilled negotiator on behalf of their buyer. They need to have good market knowledge and neighborhood knowledge to be able to educate their buyer. They need to have contract knowledge. They must be able to properly fill out a purchase agreement, addendums, disclosures, etc. They need to have some basic mortgage knowledge. Even though they're not a part of the mortgage process, they should be able to spot issues that could cause a home not to qualify for a VA loan, for example. Or they should know the maximum allowable seller paid closing costs for each loan type, like VA, conventional, FHA, USDA. They need to have a personal network of inspectors, contractors, mortgage lenders, insurance agents. They should have a wide Rolodex of people because once the deal is closed, the buyers could often ask you for a good recommendation for a good electrician or a good plumber, etc. And one of the most important things, even though it's not necessarily a skill, is having a good positive attitude, being patient, and being fun to house shop with. The house shopping process should be fun. So if you're a boring or negative person, people aren't going to want to shop for homes with you. It's that simple.